welcome or welcome back to my channel so today i'm gonna be opening some more diy paper squishy blind bags you guys have been flooding the comment section asking when my next paper squishy blind bag video is and i was a little skeptical because these take like a lot of time for me but i stayed up until 3 a.m last night trying to finish these up and i'm actually really happy with the final product but before we get started, this idea was from Sunset Squishies. Here's her TikTok and YouTube. You guys should definitely go follow and subscribe to her because this was such a cute idea and I had to recreate it. So shout out to her. Also, quick disclaimer for anyone new that's watching, this is all made of paper. I'm just unpackaging them for you guys on camera because it's actually pretty fun. And if you guys like these kinds of videos, I have a whole playlist dedicated to paper squishy blind bags on the playlist section on my channel. Also, thank you guys so much for 66,300 subscribers. That is absolutely like really crazy. We're so close to 70k and at 100k, I'm gonna be doing a face reveal, guys. Yes, I've said it here and there, but not a lot of my fans know but yes i'll be doing a face reveal at 100k subscribers and i'll be doing something a little extra but you guys will have to wait and find out but anyways let's get on to opening up these paper squishy blind bags so it looks like we have four blind bags here today and three of them look pretty similar but this one's something we haven't really seen before so let's just take a look at these these say crumble cookies paper squishy blind bags with the little label and some question marks and this cute little cookie at the side in here gonna be the paper squishies and there's just a plain back. And then this one's a little larger than the others. And it says Crumble Cookies Extra Surprise Blind Bag. And I don't think there's a squishy in here, guys. I think it's something a little different that we haven't really seen before. So I think we should open the Paper Squishy Blind Bags first. And then open the Extra Surprise. Here is the first blind bag. And let's just get this thing open. Because there shouldn't be more waiting. Okay guys, let's pull out the first item. Ooh, looks like, so it's this little envelope thing and I think here is a paper squishy cookie. Um, I'm not really sure what it might be, but it comes in this cute little envelope, so we're gonna have to put this aside. And let's see what we have in here. I think there's something else. Ooh, it says common. So I think this is like the mystery cookie and we got a common. So we're going to have to open that package up and see what we got. Comment down below if you've ever been to Crumble Cookies and if you have, what's your favorite cookie or what kind of cookie looks really good and you really want to try. Personally, I want to try the chilled sugar one. I think that one looks really yummy. But let's get into opening up this little package and see what's inside. Three, two, one. <gasps> OMG guys, it's an Oreo cookie. I love this one. This actually looks really cute. I don't think this is like an official crumble cookie one. I'll have to do more research on that. But this is how it looks. It has some little Oreo sprinkles on top and actually this looks like really good. And it's like super detailed. I love the black and white. Here's the back. I also think there's something inside here, so let's just pull it out. Okay, so here is the name of the cookie. It's called Double Oreo Cookie. And I actually named this one because I couldn't find the name online. So I just named it Double Oreo Cookie. And this is how it looks. I think it looks super cute and it's actually pretty squishy. So guys, this was our first cookie. We got the Oreo one, and I think it actually looks pretty cute in this envelope, not gonna lie. So let's get on to the next one. Okay guys, next blind bag, let's see what we get. Don't forget to drop your guesses in the comment section below. Let's pull up the first item. Again, the little envelope thing. We'll just set that down. And let's see the rarity of our item. We got ultra rare. That's actually really good. I'm excited to see what we get. So let's just open this little package. Let's squish it a little bit before. Let's just lift up the tape. And see what we get. Three, two, one. <gasps> Ooh, this one's actually pretty nice. This is how it looks. And we need to get the little piece of paper saying what it's called 
that's called raspberry cheesecake cookie oh that actually sounds really really good this is how it squishes if you guys didn't know i'm a huge fan of cheesecake so i feel like i would get this one because it seems really really good this is how it squishes and here is the back just a plain cookie color So I actually really like this one and I'm really happy we got an ultra rare. All right, now we're gonna head on to our third and final paper squishy blind bag, but don't you guys forget that we have this extra surprise one, which we're totally gonna open up after this one. So I'm just gonna take my scissors and see what's inside. So of course we have the little packaging for our cookie. And let's see the rarity. Three, two, one. <gasps> we got rare, guys. I'm actually really happy we didn't get another common because that would have been a little bad. But like the Oreo one was common, which is not that bad. But I'm really happy we got a rare. So now let's get on to opening this little package for the cookie i want you guys to drop your guesses down below in the comment section you can actually see a little bit of it peeking out already so let's just get it out three two one <gasps> omg guys look we got a lemon cookie this actually looks really really cute i really like the like the lemon ones like the oreo lemon so i feel like i would like this cookie too this is how it looks I really like the little lemon slice right here. I think it adds a lot of detail. Here is the back. Oh, you guys, we can't forget about the name. I think it's inside this little package. So, oh, it's called Lemon Glaze. That actually sounds really, really good. Comment down below if you guys like sour things because, like, I'm in love with sour things. Um, mostly like sour candy, but I don't mind a little lemon. I think it's actually pretty good. And this is actually really cute. I really like the squishy. So I'm just gonna place this back in here. Wait, last squish. This back in here and set it beside the rest of the cookies. So this is how all the paper squishies look together. I absolutely love them all, but I think my favorite is definitely the Oreo one. It was in between these two, but I think I like the Oreo one a little bit more. Then it would be the raspberry cheesecake and then the lemon glaze. Comment down below your guys' ranking because I'm really curious on what you guys think. But of course, we can't forget the extra surprise that was included in this little series. I've actually never had one of these before. And this might just be a little extra for the little collection. We'll have to wait and see. So let's take another look at it. It's fairly flat, so I want you guys to guess in the comments what this is. You can actually kind of see inside. But I'm going to take my scissors and cut through the bag. Let's see. Okay guys, I'm gonna pull it out and see what this is. Hmm, it says limited edition cookie box, build yourself. <gasps> OMG guys, so this is like a little cookie box where we can place all of our cookies. This is actually a really fun detail. It comes in this little plastic and this little like sticker and wow, I think we have to build this ourselves. So I'm actually going to just try to open this like that and get the little cardboard box out. And it comes folded, so you have to like tape it, I guess. And this is how it looks. Let's open it up and see. Ooh, there's like little lines at the edges. And there's a little like scissor thing. So I guess we have to cut these squares out, get some tape and build our little cookie box. I'm going to go build this real quick off camera and place our cookies inside the box. 
Okay guys, I am back with the cookie box and I actually really like how this looks. I think it'll look super cute with the cookies in it, but I just realized that now we have two options of packaging. I was just gonna leave them in these little envelopes and put them in my paper squishy collection, but now I can leave them in here and put them in here, or I could just take them out and put them in this little cookie box. So we have some options. So first, I think I'm going to put all of them in here with the little envelope things. Oh! Guys, I ripped it. It's okay. Well, it's fine, guys. Just pretend like that didn't happen. So, these are how they look in the little box, just for a little stand. And now we're just going to take them off of the little envelope things. Release them and put them in here. Okay, guys, I think this is a little more like it. So this is how our cookies look in the box we just made that was included in the blind bags. I think I like this way better instead of the little like envelope things that they came in. But this is actually really cute and a good way to store your paper squishies. I'm actually going to go take our crumble cookie paper squishies to our little paper squishy collection. And currently it looks like a hot mess, but um, we'll try to like get some room in it. For now, they're gonna go in the bottom right here. But we're gonna organize in a bit, but guys, don't judge me. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hopefully y'all enjoyed it and tried to make these little blind bags at home or maybe just the squishies, whatever you guys like. Again, shout out to Sunset Squishy. She is the original creator of this idea and I actually had a lot of fun with it. Again, thank you guys so much for all the support and see you in the next one. Bye.